What's yeah. that, like a little GoPro? I, it, I'm, I'm testing all sorts of little cameras. Oh, okay. Do they give them to you? No. What? They know who you are? How to... Did you get that new, what is that wow. new phone? The 123 phone or whatever it is? You got that thing, right? 123? Yeah. Isn't that what it's called? The 123 phone? It's a smartphone? No, but I've got... You won't believe the smartphones I've been buying. Suspension. That's your new front suspension because we had to change a few things because of where the placement of well, the motors this, is. This whole, the, the, yeah. this hair. This is your front cross member. These are your new upper lower control arms. In order to make room for the electric exactly. motors. Exactly. Oh, so yeah. now everything will sit in here nice. There's a custom link that we don't have a jig for. So we're just making do with what we got. Using a clamp, no big deal. We are all good. I'd like to tell you something. I don't want you to think of it something weird or inappropriate, okay? Okay. But I need you to be accepting of what I say. Okay. Ready? Okay. By you standing like a pirate in front of me does not intimidate me. I know the message that you're trying to send but it's not working, okay? You ever just like ask a question and then like in the middle of my answer, you're like, fuck, I shouldn't have asked that question. All the time. What? what? Oh, this is a weapon. Keep tripping on me, you'll find out how I use it, okay? Okay, so what are you working on right now? So I'm gapping this. <clears throat> Finish the, the rocker, top side visible part of the rocker. So I want a perfect gap all the way around the door. And it's not motherfucking doing it right now, so. They might name a, a um, holiday after that. After you? No, after the day that we put the body mount on. That's how huge it is. That's... So I'm using this. Steel weld won't stick to copper. That's, that's all it does. Oh. So what I do, since I have a small gap here, stick this in the back, that it comes out flat. Ah. It's like if you were modeling um, uh, clay, just like that. You put it on a form, and that's exactly how it comes out on the back there. So that's going to cost you. I'm going to charge you for that one. So I need to get this stuff close. So obviously when I put the body mounts on, it's gonna go into its final resting place, this body will. <clears throat> what I'm trying to do is kind of prep everything. So when I do start moving everything around and bolting it together, um, I have it close to where I want it so I can make all the final adjustments when I do get it on body mounts. Um, but like I said, it's going to be a big, it's going to be a big uh, milestone. And everywhere there's a body mount, there's going to be one of these. It needs to run uh, the, the length of the floor. So what this does is um, goes in from the bottom. And um, it stiffens the, the floor. Number two. And it gives it a stronger area to support the weight of the body. So each one of these is going to have a body mount in this area, I'm guessing closer to the edge of the car. So this is the far edge of the car. And um, body mounts usually are around here somewhere. Um, so what we'll do is we'll install this on the bottom floor section of the car. This will go down the rocker. And body mount will go here through the floor. So the floor has to be dimpled to touch this. So it's got to be like kind of like cratered, you know what I mean? Uh, to touch the, um, the stiffener here. And that's how you do it. I guess it's hard to picture. You want to see one? 
Yeah. Okay, let's one. go see. I let's go see. I, I didn't know that you were going to have to dimple the floor. Why why can't you just bolt it or weld it from underneath? Why do you have to dimple the floor? So if you dimple the floor, it makes the surrounding area stronger because it's got a conical shape. Also, it recesses the head of the bolt. Okay. In order to lay a flat carpet. Okay. Whatever you want. Got Come it. check one out. <laughs>